If you maybe possibly forgot to get someone a romantical gift and you're looking for some inspiration, then this video is for you. I won't tell them that you forgot. May I suggest that you appeal to their strongest sense? In human design, we refer to the strongest sense as your cognition, meaning it is the way that you intake the outside world. So if you get someone a gift that appeals to their strongest sense, that means that it will be well received. You can locate the strongest sense by clicking on my face and then scrolling down in the chart properties to the section that says sense. So if their strongest sense is touch, you're looking for sensory experiences or gifts with texture. A couple of ideas for sensory experiences would be a massage, but from you, because people who are strongest sense touch are very particular about the way that they're touched and by whom. Or you could get them experience that's very touchy-feely, like a pottery class where they get to get their hands dirty and feel different textures. A couple of gift ideas for strongest sense touch. You're looking for gifts with texture. So a pajama set, for example, or clothing that has a very, very nice and soft texture would be good. And my friends with strongest sense touch are obsessed with the texture of cashmere. Next up, we have strongest sense of taste. And these people are looking for cultural experiences and luxury gifts. By cultural experiences, I'm referring to like museums or art galleries. Luxury gifts would refer to classy designers or very versatile, neutral pieces. People with strongest sense of smell love immersive experiences and, naturally, gifts that smell good. An immersive experience could be something like an escape room or a cooking class. And by gifts that smell good, I mean things like candles, perfume, fresh baked goods, or flowers that smell good. Strongest sense of feeling is looking for a spiritual experience or gifts that have a vibe. A spiritual experience could be something as simple as stargazing or a session with a reader like a um, numerology reader or human design or tarot or a psychic, for example. Gifts that have a vibe would be something like crystals or tarot cards, sentimental and or handmade gifts. If inner vision would love a meditative experience or an expressive gift. A meditative experience could be something like a breathwork session, a meditation session, or even a sound bath. An expressive gift is something like art supplies, a journal, or even a dream catcher. Lastly, we have Outer Vision, and they're looking for curated experiences and collectible gifts. A curated experience would be something like thrifting or antiquing, and collectible gifts would be home decor, for example, in their favorite color, and trust me, they know what it is or DIY gifts like cookie, decorating, coloring books, or paint by numbers. Have fun expressing your love.